Adventure time! Come on, grab your friends. We'll go to very distant lands. We'll take the dog and then the kill and the book will never end. It's adventure Oh, <laughs> hello! Good to see you again! I reckon you've come for some more Greybones. Oh, Greybo Babel, I wasn't expecting you today. I was planning on play Babeling games on my viewer device, but I would hate for you to come all this way for nothing. Oh, I have an incredible thought idea. We can do both. Instead of watching the Greybones, you'll play Babel then. I'll drop you into five playable Greybolts, all relating to the same theme, to explore and puzzle out. Okay, grab your game input units, Mabel, and get set. I'll be back at the end to see if you can Greyble out the theme. <laughs> Find anything to do yet, Bimo? Yeah, I'm bored. Not yet. <sighs> Dance party! Hey, that's the record mom and dad used to play for me when I couldn't sleep. Don't break it! Ow! Nice going, Bimo. You wrecked the record player. Where did this stuff come from? My tree hole. Huh? You know how you got that place in your head where you keep all that mind stuff you don't want to deal with? My vault. Yep. Well, I got a bunch of stuff too. Only it's real stuff. But I still don't want to deal with it. So, I just jam it in my tree hole. Sure is a lot of stuff. Yeah, I like stuff. I don't like putting it away. <laughs> Ow! Hey, what's this? That's something that used to belong to Mom and Dad, back when they used to investigate monsters and stuff. They printed out adventures and missions for them to go on. Cool. Think it still works? Nah, I don't think so. It's pretty old. Bimo made the old monster machine go. Yay, Bimo! Whoa, check it out. Looks like one of those missions you were talking about. You know what I'm thinking? Then I need a bigger tree hole? No, man! We should start using this thing to find adventures to go on, like Mom and Dad. Hey, yeah! Mom and Dad would want that! And you know how much I like police work. Kinda weird this thing just showed up and started working, though. I don't even remember putting it in my tree hole. Psh, whatevs. Weird stuff happens to us all the time. Oh, yeah. So what are we waiting for? Let's get all up in the investigating biz. Finn and Jake investigations! Yeah, boy! Yay! Bimo is an investigator! Um, I don't think you're ready for field work yet, Bimo. You could be our secretary. Yay! Bimo is a secretary! What should I do first, boss? How about cleaning up the office? This place is a mess. And see if you can fix the record player. It's totally jacked up. Can't have a post-investigation dance party if the record player's jacked up. <sighs> Look! There's a new case available on the ticker type. Babel Nable, it's Cooper here again. You Grables are probably new to playable Grables, I reckon. I'll offer you some help from time to time so you don't get your mind labels too confused. <laughs> Would you like some tutorial help from your pal, Cooper? When you get near something important, it gets all sparkly label and a little menu thingy comes up. That means you can do stuff to it. To look at something, press the button on your control device that matches the look icon. Look at every. You'll miss lots of important puzzle clues if you don't. When you get a new case that needs investigating, the ticker type machine will Babel Grable a new print thingy for you to read. When you read the ticker type message, you just have to press the correct button thingy to travel to the start of the new investigation. There's always a Finn and Jake case to go and explore, but there's no hurry. Go ahead and look around your treehouse. There are lots of things to blable with and look at.
Maybe you should get a real bed. Glad I never need a desk. This thing's a mess. I think Dad would be proud of us, Jake. Our first case! Candy Kingdom on lockdown after citizens vanish. Whoa, Jake! We better get to the Candy Kingdom. It sounds serious. I've got a tutorial thingy for you. You want to see it? Playable Grables are all about exploring. Wherever you are, make sure you check out every corner. You can touch and grab and use things in the world by pressing the Interact Label control on your input device. All the thingies you pick up go into your inventory. You can put one of them in your hand by opening the inventory and choosing it. When you have something in your hand, you can use it on other things in the world. That includes your stretchy dog friend, Jake. Use him on interact spots to get to hard to reach places like the castle moat. He can do other stuff for you too. It never hurts to experiment with using Jake on things. When you meet people in the world, you should be nice and talk to them. Just walk up and select the speech bubble thingy. Guards at the gate. Must be serious. We need to get inside and help PB. Can you let us through? Um, I'm gonna need to see some ID first. But you know who we are. We've been here a zillion times. That's exactly what you'd say if you were trying to sneak in. I need to see your ID or you're not getting in. How come the princess has shut down the Candy Kingdom? What's going on? A bunch of people have disappeared, including Peppermint Butler. The princess told us to make sure nobody gets in or out without proper ID. Um, we don't have any ID. Sorry, Finn. If you guys don't have ID, how do I know who you and Jake are? Hi, Finn. Bye, Jake. Maybe Jake could do something here. That's not working. That ain't working, dude. You think there's something I could help you with here? I bet Jake could help me out here. I could probably help you out here, you know. You just asked. Maybe I should get Jake to help me. Hey, did you see that? Stop those guys. How come? The princess said keep people out of the castle, not the moat. Oh yeah, I guess you're right. Hey, be careful down there. There's lots of broken glass. And one of the grates on those pipes that lead into the castle is loose and rusty. Broken glass? Somebody should clean this up. No way we're getting in through there. If that grate weren't so strong, we could probably break it. No way we're getting in through there. The grate's really rusty on this one. You're gonna need something to break it with. I swear, I don't even have a criminal record. Somebody help! Jake, Africa Daniel's in trouble. We have to help him. Would you like some tutorial help from your pal, Cuba?
probably owns those guys. You said it, dude. We got tons of loot. Doesn't get much better than that. That's enough, you two. Abracadaniel is under arrest for kidnapping my citizens. No way. Abracadaniel wouldn't hurt a fly. Like, literally. For a wizard? Kinda lame. I'll be in the castle surveillance room if you want to see proof. Meanwhile, Abracadaniel is going to the dungeon. Guards! Take him away! Don't worry, Abracadaniel. This isn't over. Finn and Jake investigations will totally clear your name. Those doors lead to the royal foyer. Must be locked. That's the door to the security room. Finn and Jake investigations to the rescue. What can we do to help, Princess? Thanks for coming, guys. Sorry I had to arrest your friend. Why did you arrest Abraka Daniel? There's no way he's a kidnapper. Sorry, Jake, but the facts don't lie. Facts, huh? What are these so-called facts? Well, someone trashed the cameras so that nothing would be recorded. We also found a note that says wizards rule. Abrick Daniel is the only wizard anyone saw in the Candy Kingdom last night. It doesn't take a genius to see that he's the kidnapper. Can we talk to Abrick Daniel? I think it's important to hear his side of the story, too. No way. He's being held in the dungeon, and he's going to stay there unless someone can prove him innocent. What'll it take to prove he's innocent? Look for clues and interview people. You can start in Peppermint Butler's room across the hall. He was one of the kidnapped people. I'll be here if you find anything. Chamomile tea. Princess Bubblegum likes to drink this stuff when she's stressed out. No can do. It's locked. It's locked. Those doors lead to the royal foyer. Hey, Finn. Hey, Jake. Sorry, kitchen's off limits. You need to get permission from the princess. Sorry, Finn. If you want to get into the dungeon, you'll have to prove that Africa Daniel is innocent. I've got a tutorial thingy for you. Do you want to see it? You can pick up a lot of thingies you find while exploring. Pick something up by interacting with it. You should pick up everything you can. You never know if you might need it later. Hi! Starchy, you know anything about the missing candy people? Maybe so. Last night, Starchy was walking the halls, sliding pamphlets for the Veritas Brigade under people's doors. Did you see something? Well, no, but as I was sliding a pamphlet under Peppermint Butler's door, I heard a struggle inside. Sounded like a kidnapping. You heard Peppermint Butler getting kidnapped, and you didn't help him? Sounds kind of fishy. Now hold on! I wanted to help. I really did. I tried to bust through the door when he called for help, but, well, Starchy's not as young as he used to be. Thanks, Starchy. This has been very helpful. 
You betcha! I just hope you two can get to the bottom of this mess. That's not working. Candelabra. Nice. Needs candles, though. Peppermint Butler has good taste in candle-holding accessories. Except it's not holding candles. It's one of the Gumball Guardians. I wonder if he saw something. Hey, GG! Did you guys notice anything suspicious on the night of the kidnapping? Well, we saw Africa Daniel enter the Candy Kingdom, but we didn't think anything of it. Not long after that, I heard a crash and saw him sneak into Peppermint Butler's room through this window. Did you see any other wizards around? No, just Africa Daniel. Look at this mess. He must have spilled those jelly beans when he broke in. The kidnappers had to have tracked us in here, Jake. Yeah! Maybe they left a leaf trail. We can follow it and see how they got in and out. There were a bunch of leaves in the hallway earlier, but I swept them up. They led toward the kitchen. Nice! We should go check it out. You won't be able to go anywhere until you solve the mystery, but even then you might run into trouble. The guard inside the kitchen is really strict. Here's my business card. If he stops you when you're in the kitchen, just give it to him and say Banana Guard 182 says it's cool. Sweet! Thanks, BG-182! That ain't working, dude. Candelabra. Nice. Needs candles, though. Somebody spilled jelly beans all over the floor, and onto those pamphlets! Hmm, some kind of circle thingy. Jack. Sorry, kitchen's off limits. You need to get permission from the princess. That's enough cotton candy to last, like, a year! I don't think that guy's gonna let us in the dungeon. That's the door to the security room! Shouldn't you guys be investigating something? Finn! Jake! How's the investigation going? Did you find anything? I think Jake and I found all the evidence we need to solve the mystery and clear Abraka Daniel's name. Of course! How could I have missed it? Finn, you totally proved that Abraka Daniel is innocent. Um... We did? Of course! Here, let me walk you through it. What fell on the floor while the kidnapping was taking place? Jelly beans! They were all over the place. Yes, but they couldn't have fallen first. Try again. Starchy's pamphlet. He was sliding it under Peppermint Butler's door when he heard the kidnapping. Yes, exactly. And what item do we know fell on the floor when Abraka Daniel entered the room? The jelly beans. They were on top of the pamphlet, so they had to have fallen after the pamphlet was already there. Right. Okay, so, the jelly beans were on top of the pamphlet. What does that mean? That paper is heavier than jelly beans. 
that's why the pamphlet sunk to the bottom. <laughs> I'm getting good at this detective stuff. No, you're not. <sighs> Let's try it again. What fell on the floor while the kidnapping was taking place? Starchy's pamphlet. He was sliding it under Peppermint Butler's door when he heard the kidnapping. Yes, exactly. And what item do we know fell on the floor when Abracadaniel entered the room? The jelly beans. They were on top of the pamphlets, so they had to have fallen after the pamphlet was already there. Right. Okay, so, the jelly beans were on top of the pamphlet. What does that mean? That Abrick and Daniel had to come in after the kidnapping. Otherwise, the jelly beans he knocked over would have been under the pamphlet. Exactly! I'm sorry I doubted you, Finn. Abrick Daniel is free to go. Go down to the dungeon, get the key from the guards, and release him. It's important that you stay inside the Candy Kingdom until the crisis is over, though. The Gumball Guardians will zap anybody who tries to leave while we're on lockdown. Mathematical! Nice! <laughs> Out of here! Jail does not look like a fun place to be. That's a sturdy looking door. We're gonna need to use the cell key to open the door. Nah, I don't think so. That's a sturdy looking door. Maybe Jake could do something here. Why would I do that? That did exactly nothing. That must be the guard who has the key. Hey, the princess said you would have the key to the cell. Um, I did, but me and my buddy, he was on the last shift. We were playing catch with the keys, and well, they got stuck on the ledge up there. I get them for you, but I'm kind of new, and I don't start climbing to reach high stuff training until next week. Sorry, Finn. I could probably help you out here, you know. You just asked. <laughs> That's a sturdy looking door. No point trying to open the cell without using a key. Thanks for getting me out, Finn. I was really afraid that I'd be rotting in that candy prison forever. No problem, man. It's what we do. We knew you weren't guilty. Yeah, but why were you prowling around the Candy Kingdom? It did look kind of shady, what with the missing people and all. I wasn't bothering anybody. All I was doing is looking for my favorite cake plate. I lent it to Peppermint Butler a while ago, but I need it back right away. I heard about a really cool wizard party that's about to happen. It's so cool that a whole delegation of people from the Candy Kingdom were brought in as guests. Delegation of candy people? Dude, those are the people who are missing. 
And somehow, I don't think they're guests at this so-called party. Sounds like some wizards are up to no good. Oh, I guess I really didn't think this through. Abracadaniel, can you take us to the party? Sure, but not without my cake plate. It's bad manners not to bring something, and I'm not putting my famous rainbow fluff cake on just any cake plate. Fine, where is it? I'm not sure. I tried to find it in Peppermint Butler's room, but the place was a mess. I was gonna try Chet's house too, but I didn't get a chance because of, well, being arrested and all. Okay, we'll start looking there. The faster we find it, the faster we can get out of here and find those people. Dude, don't forget that PB has the kingdom on lockdown. We'll need to find a way out. Oh yeah, I almost forgot about that. Well, as soon as you two find my cake plate and a way to get out of the kingdom, I'll take you to the party. I'll wait for you here. Good luck! Yeah! Yeah! <laughs>